What's going on guys? It's King Jersey here in downtown Denver for game two of the NLL championship series. Buffalo Bandits are leading one to zero following game one on Saturday in Buffalo. Now we're in Denver at the Loud House and we're gonna experience how loud it really is. Last year, Colorado beat Buffalo in the championship. It's a rematch this year. And you know Buffalo's hungry and they looked really good throughout the entire playoffs. So let's go see what happens.
Just got back home from the game, and man, what a game. Colorado looked fantastic tonight. Ryan Lee was unstoppable on the offensive end, and you couldn't get anything past Dylan Ward. Just save after save after save. Buffalo, they tried to chip away. You know, Tohoka and Anacoke really kept them in the game, but it seemed like every time that they scored one, Colorado would score two right back, and... By the end of it, man, was it getting chippy. A bunch of Buffalo players ended up in the penalty box. Loud House, it lived up to its name. It was loud. Fantastic atmosphere, especially for a little over 10,000 fans there tonight. Which for a NLL game, very good attendance. If you've never been to a game, highly, highly recommend it. I mean, it's got the perfect mix of, you know, just gritty, brutal brute force chippy and then there's the elegance and beauty and diving shots and behind the back passes behind the back goals goalies laid out and then yeah laid out guys you know get in a fight throw some punches it just it's that perfect mix and about the perfect amount of goals to keep it interesting where you're completely locked in the entire game. And lacrosse, just what a beautiful sport. Let's be honest. What a beautiful sport. If you don't know a lot about it, or I'm assuming you do if you're clicking on this video, go to an NLL game if you haven't. Go to a PLL game. Help the game grow. It's just great. It's awesome. And uh, I couldn't recommend it anymore. Championship series. Hope it comes home to Colorado. But... We leave that till next week. Until next time, peace.